right, Theo snuck his way down the stairs and is at the top right of the map. So, Theo, you are sneaking down, and it looks like you guys have found basically the armory for the Tower of Ashal. There's racks and racks and racks of all kinds of different armors. All of these things you guys see up here are um, be anywhere between leather jerkins to sets of split mail just up on the wall. Some of the weapon racks still have stuff in them, but many have been cleared out. Um, they look like just cheaply manufactured, throw something in there kind of backup weapons, so mm -hmm. nothing particularly amazing. Uh, Drastov is getting ready to break through the chest up here. Lucius is looking through the bookshelves. And Avalons, you are standing where you are. Your mind is going back to the very traumatic experience you had drinking from that chalice and watching everyone else, and Ash died. And your mind keeps going back to the strange things that you saw, the armies and legions of Darkspawn underground, the undead dragon that roared in defiance at you. It's making your skin crawl. But something about this place is too. Give me a perception check. Hmm. You get uh, it too. I about to say, do I add my plus two? Nice. <laughs> Hopefully I won't roll shit perception for once. That would be helpful. You got this. Well, 14. <laughs> well, well dirt. <laughs> fairly certain that you guys are not alone in this building, though that's the best you can do. Oh, well, no. Going through the bookshelves. Yeah. You're making a perception check. All right. What exactly are you looking for? Just seeing if there's anything of uh, anything of note that would stick out to me. I'm, I'm not looking for anything specific. Uh, interesting things that you happen to find. You find guard rotations, uh, troop transportation, supply routes, things like that. Um, find some historical texts of who's who, some VIPs to the area over the last year. Does any of this sound of interest to you? Um, the historical texts, the VIPs, and trade routes, those three things, I will stuff those away for later reference, and uh, that'll be me. Feel free to Passively keeping an eye on the dwarf. It'll take some time to go through them, so you'll have to settle down later to read it. Yeah. Dress up. You're getting ready to bust open this chest. Is the 23 enough to break it? Slam the crowbar into it. You get a good edge on it. You rear up, and you put your whole body on it, and crack! The top spikes open. No noxious gases or arrows fly at you, and you bust the chest open successfully. Inside, pages, some documents, and a couple of red liquids in bottles. Anything important in the text, first and foremost? The documents. We are getting, these are sealed documents. Most of them look like ledgers for things that were purchased or sold. Um, you find some unusual stuff discussing selling people to other regions, though it was kept intentionally vague. Mm. Yeah, but you do find afraid. two minor potions of healing and one standard potion of healing. Potion, not elixir, correct? Potion. Okay. Every little bit helps. Uh, every, absolutely. Um, I'm going to just grab the documents that seem important in case they need to be saved. But otherwise, I'm immediately turning around and handing a potion to the old man. And I'm also going to hand a potion to Avalon. As you guys are distributing the supplies that Drastov just found, Theo, you find yourself at the height of the stairs. You also... Oh wait, you didn't take the war. You didn't take the joining. No. You're gonna are you maintaining your stealth? Are you walking down the stairs loud and oh, proud? No, no, I'm 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 still maintaining it and I'm I'm trying to be perceptive. Like, I know there's trouble in here, so yeah, I'm being I I would if I could go that's a I think that's a wall, yeah. What are you looking at? Right in front of me, is that a wall? It is stand for all of the armor so it's not a wall up to the ceiling it's about four feet tall you can easily see over it from where you are 
So I would go up to that and just be like using that as cover to hide behind while being stealthy. So yeah, I'd still be maintaining my stealth while looking up and down this corridor to make sure there's no one else I see here. In the area, since you went to a lower floor, so give me a new stealth check. Hmm? Uh, character sheet. I need to stop putting this away. I hate it. Every time I change, it always puts my character shit away. Eric, real quick question. Those were minor and lesser potions, correct? Two minor, one lesser? Minor and one lesser. What? Two minors and one lesser. Okay. Theo, you easily dart between the shadows. You are the shadow yourself. Give me a perception check. I am the shadow. Sorry, I don't know why. I just thought that would be like the way I'd say that. Just have to be cool. Oh, yeah. Motion here, here, and down here. Perfect. Can I stealthily, with that check, move up to the edge here to peek around to see what I see? We'll let the others have their actions first. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. So I've just passed out supplies that he shared with everyone else. I would just take and put the potion away. Mm -hmm. Stuff is good. Right. right, next door. I'm just going to bust down every door methodically, just in case there's any fuckers in there. Next one, real quick. Is it locked? This door is unlocked, but it is closed. Are you going to try the handle, or are you just going to break it in? I'm just going to open it and keep my shield between me and the door. The door opens. It doesn't resist you. You don't get shot at by anything. And this looks like a, a decent little dining room. There's still food on the table that wasn't eaten. Nothing of interest. Door gets closed. Moving on. Hmm. Wait, that dwarf just refused food? I'm sorry, I have a job to do, you fuck. <laughs> As you are walking through this area, you're going to give me a reflex check. Okay. You hold the ground, you don't fall, but you notice that you are standing in a very thick sheen of grease on the floor. Ah, shit. Next to open flame. Yep. I am going to barrel towards the door and jump, basically try to shoulder it open. <laughs> Athletics. Boom. Nice. Boom! Drastoff torpedoes himself through the door. And there's a whole bunch of scuttling coming from the northern and south, and south extremes of the room. With that... That was impressive. See <laughs> you. Perception check. What what Plus I would two. what I would like to do while while I'm doing this MV, I'm looking for what seems to be the most high value target out of these guys. If that's doable, if they're all just basic basic bitches, that's fine. But it's essentially looking for the most dangerous person if I can perceive that. That makes sense. Yes, but first, you got to pass. You get a plus yeah. two because you're in a good situation. So what? Twenty-seven. Nice. You reveal all of these dudes. As you are noticing them, and you heard the smashing of a door in this direction, the archers of the group dip their arrows into the torches that are nearby, light them, and start firing them in this direction. Cool. Dressed of Avalyn and Lucius, the three of you will give me reflex checks. Huh. Oh, I guess a flare-up, that makes sense. Yep. You're not in the fire, so yeah, yeah, as long as you don't really fail, you'll be fine. <laughs> yeah, me and Lucia are like, nope. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No. 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 That old man still no. gets moves. No. Oh, oh god, old man has moves. He's used to ducking away from fire. It's part of his <laughs> profession. He's dealt with plenty of <laughs> He's had enough explosions in the face, so he's learned his lesson. Okay. 
The grease on the floor ignites into raging fires, but no one was caught in it. And with that, everyone grab your tokens and roll initiative. Clicky, clicky token. Uh, Eric, would I see for how well I've done like stealthily and stuff like that? And kind of thinking out of the box, would I gain any more panache for that? or You don't gain panache for sneaking around. You can roll initiative with stealth as you are concealed right now if you want, I think. They are unaware of you, so they're not going to react to you. Are you want me to roll initiative or no, sorry? Yes. Yeah, right, okay. We're about to start combat. Fucking yes! The LB is not in initiative order yet. No, there's quite a few. That's why I haven't done it yet. Burn, baby, burn. So you guys, normally you have the whole kind of like you never split the party um, chat. I made the mistake of obviously not telling everyone, but it's worked out in our, worked out in our favor so far. But yeah, um, that's normally the number one rule. One minute. There's a lot of initiatives here, so sit tight. Yeah, then. I think we're going to have to just categorize you as, okay, we're preparing for a fight. Well, he's going to do this, she's going to do this, he's going to do this. Well, what about Bondrak? Well, he's just going to go off and do rogue assassin things. <laughs> Don't worry about him. Just rogue things. <laughs> Look, as, as, plan as, is as, very as, simple. I just run in and scream like an idiot. The enemy sees the dwarf that is screaming at them and they ignore the sneaky Tevinter. It is a very simple plan, but I assure you, it is effective. Mm -hmm. it'll probably, it's not going to work all the time. Uh, and obviously, oh, and, and in future, I'll make sure you give someone a heads up. That's something I should have done. So sorry for that. But it's worked out in our favor so far. Um, but yeah, my character is, is kind of going to do that kind of stuff. Like He's all about being bravado like. As long as it works. Yeah, exactly. I, I was thinking. Off. I was thinking the rule of cool. What would, what's going to give me some panacea? I mean, why wouldn't I climb up this tower and smash in a window and sneak down? All right. With all of that done, it is time for actual combat. Theo, first one in the turn order. Yeah, um, I am going to hold my turn until these guys move further away. Because mm -hmm. cool. what, what I would like to do is then get close to these guys with no pokey pokey melee melee to protect them. Want to get Wasted by random spear dude like Jack. Uh, I mean, I, I would like to be brave enough to think that's not going to happen to me. But listen, you, you never know. I don't want to, don't want to tempt fate. Um, but yeah, I am going to uh, withhold my turn at the moment. As soon as, as soon as these guys move away, like it's, it doesn't matter. Like if if all these guys move away, so if if these spear guys are the last guys to take their turn, I am then reacting and moving up right here to then attack these guys or attack this guy. Dressed up. Important question: Is the fire already out? Has it just the fire is burning, burning, but it's rapidly consuming the fuel. So it's not gone, but it looks like it will be shortly. So if I just walk through it, it won't deal any damage. Is that what I'm getting here? You'd be walking through a raging fire. It would hurt. Mm. I have no problem with waiting. But quick question. Is this spot not burning? That little spot doesn't have any fuel to eat, so it is not on fire. I'm moving over here, raising my shield and taking cover. Come on, I'm waiting. <laughs> That'll be all. Lucius. He's dead. Oh. Lucius, roll a new character. <laughs> what? Uh, fucking just... mute button. Yeah, yeah I'm not walking through you. fire. So um, <laughs> I will move up a little bit and, and just wait. It's just chilling, okay? Mm-hmm. 
This dude starts to advance. Quick question, just for reference. Is is the fire burning really, really tall? So, example, could I see the dwarf at this point? You can see him, yes. Okay. It's not reaching the sky. And it's only able to consume the grease that was on the floor. So it won't take long before it snuffs itself out. Gotcha. Good move, Fia. Are you holding? Yes, I am. I'm waiting for these guys to move. Okay. This archer moves. One of the spearmen moves. He is waiting. Only moving slowly. He is waiting. Other spearmen move. I would then like to react. Okay. Oh, the music just picked up as well. Ha ha! Let us do the dance of death! And I'm going <laughs> to strike at this guy. Uh, it appears we have the Tavinta code word being yelled. And I will do that with Finisher. He is totally unaware. Imagine he's flat as well. Yeah, flat footed. Yep. Oh my. 17? <laughs> 17 for 14. Is that enough? The archers, after they've set off the fire trap, Theo sneaks up on one, and as that archer is preparing to ready another arrow and move into position, Theo comes up behind him, puts his mouth over his or hand over his mouth so he can't make any noise, covers his nose so he can't breathe. And Theo just rams the rapier right through his back, slams it into his spine, and just drops the dude cold on the floor. <laughs> oh, I love being this good. <laughs> um, so that was... See here. So I still have my panache and my other action. I'm then going to move up behind this guy. Obviously, I'm not. I don't want to fucking ignite in the fire. V, come on. Like, I'm. What's that? I'm like right here. Like, imagine if I can, I'm right in there. Like, just hiding, but I, I like hiding behind a little barricade if that's possible. After I've killed him, and then just waiting to strike out this guy again. It's going to be another stealth check to have not been noticed. That's fine. <laughs> oh, oh, I, am, I am death! I am the shadows! I am the night. I am your nightmares. I'm going to put the fear <laughs> into the dark spawn. They will fear! Theodore Humphrey Farquhar von Drake. Theo has become the, the rape demon. Theo Avalon. has become the anal editor. <laughs> Avalon, you're up. He's the anal ritter. <laughs> Just call him Roto Rooter. I said, whatever, <laughs> wh whatever strikes feet, I don't care. Clean out the pipes. Um, well, I mean, they're uh, joining the club of other people. There is currently fire in my way. Um, at least you weren't in it. Yeah. Well. I have an inconvenient restriction that I have to deal with, which is because I because we apparently I have the shield out, which to be fair, I picked it up. Action stow shield because I need to have my great sword out to spell cast. You can always just drop it on the ground, which doesn't cost an action. I guess that's fair. Mm hmm. You just yeah, have to I pick it up later. Yeah, I'll have to come back and get it, but I think for the moment I need my economy more importantly. So throw a shield away really quick, pull out my greatsword so I can spell cast, and double check my distance. I'm 90% sure he's within range. He's not. God damn it. You can move up a little bit. I, I, I mean, two squares, though? I feel like I'm going to step in fire. 
Yeah, that's close enough more. that you're not in trouble. Well, I need thirty feet. Uh, that sucks. Don't worry, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Uh, Avalyn seems to be perpetually out of position all the time. <laughs> uh, actually, I have an idea. I'm going. Uh, if you don't mind me undoing, because in hindsight, I like since I can't do that, I should have thought my turn out better and check distances. Um, undo. I'm still gonna have the shield on. I am delaying my turn until the fire goes out. Going right. on the assumption that the fire will extinguish on initiative pass one or something like it. <laughs> okay. And, uh, yeah. This archer moves up. Come on, Mr. Brood, I'm waiting. Brood advances. This archer moved, totally unaware of Theo. <laughs> that one is dead. We'll remove him from the turn order. All right. So that will be round one. I'm going to move all the shit that you can't see all at one time. All right, Theo, you're up. Round two. Um, <laughs> okay. Hmm. But none of them have noticed that he's that he's obviously just died. As of now, no, no one's aware of you. Stealth OP. So well, well, I mean, stealthy again. I'm gonna, I'm gonna wait again. I, I want, I want these guys to detach themselves even more from the range units. So I'm gonna try and play it smart. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm, I'm back. What I'm betting on right now, uh, V, is for this archer and this archer to move first. Okay. Now, if they do move first, my plan of attack is to dart across, kill him, and then dart behind this armor rack or the weapon rack and hide. Does that make sense? You can pick one triggering action, not two. Yeah, so so my, my, my triggering action is that these two archers move before this one. That makes sense? Uh, yes. I don't actually know if that's how it works out or not. If you want the rules as written, you can go whenever somebody finishes an initiative order. That is when you can decide, I am changing my initiative right after theirs. Okay, so I will change my initiative um, after the archers move. It does stay oh, there yeah. permanent. It does stay there, however. In fact, oh, no, nah, I don't want to do that. That's really... Mm. Fuck it, let's just do it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to move here, attack him. I'm going to attack this guy. Okay, give me a stealth. Mm. It was burning him. Ouch. Ooh. As you sneak up, you pop a rock with the tip of your foot and it fires off the side of your shoe and smacks into the wall. They are now aware of you as they turn to face you. However, it doesn't stop you from attacking. Hello there. And I'm going to straight come with my rapier. What finisher? Stab, stab, stab. Ah! Mm. Fuck it, I'm, I'm, I'm using hero point. Fuck it, I'm using a hero point, I don't care. No hero point. Eric, what? <laughs> Eric, Eric already disallowed them when I used them. No hero point. Yes. Because he's a pansy. Alright. It's time for the fun shit. Odd or even. Oh, what? Okay, roll a d4 and do not hit odd. Oh god, we're doing critical fumbles again. I'm fine. <laughs> Dude, I'm fine, man. I've got this shit. Theo is as surprised as the enemy when that rock 
fires off his shoe and smacks into the wall. And as he is running up to try to stab the archer, the archer is at least aware enough that it's happening and fumbles around the attack. Cool. Um, and then with my third action, I'm going to attack again. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Is that with a uh, even with the penalty? So that that will be uh, that will be a nineteen, and that is fifteen damage on this guy. Wait, did you you'd already used the finisher though, didn't you? I didn't hit. I didn't hit though. So I, 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 I yeah, started. but but you attacked with it. Yeah, if you don't okay, insta murder, so it does go. Be... If it doesn't land, it's still consumed. Okay, so just so just take off the take off the five. So it's ten. So then it'd be ten plus uh, a one, uh, ten plus two, so it's twelve. Yep. He dodges the first attack where you try to like snake strike right at his throat, and he moves his head out of the way almost reflexively. You are as surprised as he is that you didn't hit, but you lower your arm and you puncture through his chest. He is not having a good day and is bleeding heavily. Dressed up. I will change my initiative until somebody gets uh, close to me. I'll go after whenever the first one gets uh, right up in my face. Which means the shield stays up. Come on, come to Papa. Away. The fires have burned out and have consumed all the fuel in the area. Lucius. Is All right. Ready to action go? Mad Scotsman, thank you. Subscribing, I apologize, guys. The the alerts aren't on at the moment just because every other member would hear it. So I apologize. It's just so they doesn't interrupt the role play. But Mad Scotsman, thank you so much. Got a wee shout out for Mad Scotsman in chat here. So guys, we're playing Pathfinder, which is like D D. So there's a lot of role play and stuff like that and, and into this. So I apologize that I'm not paying attention in the chat. I'm so sorry. Um it's just it kinda helps keep everything flowing. So I apologize for that, guys. And dwarf. Dwarf. Yes, because dwarf oh. has not changed his name yet, so I don't know what his name is. <laughs> Shield other is. I take half his damage and he takes half damage. Ooh. Alright. That's very so... kind of you. I basically, I think it's fair to say we have like an 80 hit point health bar now, probably a 90 hit point health bar. I have 53. How much do you have? 42. <laughs> yes. Go, go wild. <laughs> Evelyn moves forward, senses her opportunity. And as she steps up, she takes the hilt of her weapon and holds both of her hands and her weapon against her chest, lowers her head and cites a little prayer to herself. All of a sudden, there's a light blue shimmer around Drastov and Avalon. A prayer. Yeah, that's a funny joke. Uh, Loving uh, ways I can't move more. I can't move more than thirty away from you, otherwise the spell breaks. Ah. <laughs> Lucius, some magical fuckery has happened. Indeed. Um. So let's see. Moving up. You can take cover behind my shield if you want. Uh, so channel points, I mean, you can, I'll be honest though, dude, it's probably better that you save it for another time, it's just because I've not disabled them, sorry, I'm, I was going to disable channel points just, just for this stream, um, channel points and like the alerts and stuff like that should all be disabled, just so again it doesn't interfere with the other guys, um, but I would say save it, I would say save it for a better time, not that I don't appreciate you want to, want, want to interact with the stream, it's just, I don't want you to waste your points, dude, that's all, but listen, I appreciate you interacting, thank you so much. Yeah, I'm going to take an additional move and move here. And then... Oh God, why would you do that? I'm going to chunk a frost vial right here. All right, roll your attack. Yeah. You're hitting that dude up front. Oh, 
Fuck's sake. Even, <laughs> even, <laughs> even, even, even. <laughs> okay. Odd or even? Uh, we'll go odd. Okay, do not hit odd. Roll a d4. Oh no, you should have listened to William. <sighs> Good. Four. Don't listen to me that time. <laughs> Lucius is so excited and is so flabbergasted by what's going on as he's reaching for the bottle and gets ready to ignite it. He pops the cork and he holds it back too far and the liquid spills all over the floor. Whoops. Damn it. <laughs> Did just get just off and Avalon witness your ineptitude. Just get the beast. They step. smile. The dark spawn look at you and they smile at your ineptitude. Right. I would like to take my turn after this is got. over because I just I need to save the old man. Otherwise he's about to be fucked. <laughs> well, his I turn am... just ended because he did all three of his actions. Yeah. I know, that's why I'm now taking mine. I wanted to delay it until the enemy, so I guess throw me on initiative 25 now. Uh, 22. Fuck, that screws my turn a bit. You witness the going... old man get far too excited and largely just make a mess on the floor. Yes, get horribly <laughs> out of position. So many jokes to be made uh... right now. <laughs> I left it open to interpretation. <laughs> I am going to get over here, spend one action to shove the old man behind me, and then raise my shield. Do you resist? Do not resist. No, Stop because resisting. you're... <laughs> you are a large walking Abrams tank. I think we clarified this already, which terrifies me. No, I'm not going to resist. Good. Then I'm moving you right behind the wall and behind my tower shield, because I don't want you to be peppered by a dozen arrows. <laughs> Sadly, as I had to shove the old man, I am out of actions. Grastov, what do you think of your compatriots so far? Oh god, he just broke fucking basic tactics. <laughs> uh, this is why I should have just... I should have just let myself be killed down at the deep roads. This would have been easier. <laughs> Join your Legion of the Dead. Or Damned. I don't know what that is. Dead. Oh god, I'd actually work with people that know what they're doing. Imagine. Right. Okay. Lucius and Drasta, both of you, perception check. Does the docks, uh, the docks one bonus apply? Yes, both of you get a plus two. So, 21. Nice. Lucius? Sorry. Stuff's cutting out. Let me turn this down. Just repeat that, please. What you need me to do? Perception with a plus two. Ooh, 25. Nice. Yeah. Both of you see that someone is trying to sneak up on you. He becomes revealed because what? of the dark spawn bonus. That's my job. Go on. Try to fucking hit me, bitch. One will try to hit you. Okay, AC 25. Come on. Yeah, no, he rolled a four. He walks up on you, and he just swats at you with his sword. And you almost let him hit you. You kind of roll it off of your shoulder plate. He'll try to swing one more time. With a minus five, good luck. Uh, no, he rolled a net one. So, Drasta, since he attacked you. Odd or even? Even. Always even, Steven. Okay, roll a d4. Land an even. Oh boy, let's go. Uh, You've got Leon. No. Ah, oh, shame. shame. Oh well. You feel him lose control of his weapon, but he manages to hold on to it. Uh, protecting the old man is more important than trying to capitalize here. I really wish this chat could hear the music. It's like some sort of Castlevania remix. Very good. It is Bloody Tears. Bloody Tears, possibly the best Castlevania song of all time. And I think that's that the no... best cover I've ever heard. There is no possibility. Covers are it is covers. Covers. Someone is taking fire. Drastov seems to be the guy in the hot spot. 
Uh, no, oh. this guy rolled a two. Drastov, you feel an arrow sail past the back of your head. I don't even need my full plate of shield for this shit. <laughs> the archer that is now trapped in combat with Theo drops his, his bow and tries to, to poke you with a short sword. <laughs> your AC is... 20. 20. Yes. He I... takes a swing at you, and you just circle parry it around with your rapier. I'm just going. I'm just going to point out there as well. Um, I know you've got like ten other things to do, but if you can, obviously, just make it make me aware when I am in melee, and if they do do a natural one, because I do get an opportunity to repost if that is the case. If, if they get in that one, be, I'll call it. Yeah, just just doesn't just have to be natural one actually. I mean, just needs to be minus ten your AC. So if they roll a ten, anything below a result of ten triggers this. A, a four within your reach crit critically fails a straight against you. I think a critical yep. fail. I mean, I I don't know. I've not checked it out. I thought a critical fail was just a nat one. But if it's below. Long story short is, uh, is critical success is a natural 20. Well, no. A natural 20 increases the degree of success by one step. Mm -hmm. So usually that is a critical, and a natural one always decreases it by one step. But. Succeeding or failing 10... by a matter of 10 or more right, okay. considered yep. critical. Perfect. Okay. Uh, Spear Dude runs up and tries to poke Drastov, who just parries both the spear attempts twice. Something dangerous is happening. One of the thugs, Lucius and Drastov, as before, perception of the two. Okay. Ah, uh, old man's got this. Ah, oh, dwarf's nice. got this. We have another guy revealed before he can make his attack. Nice. One of the thugs, big boys. This one is going for Lucius. Lucius is undercover, so plus two AC. Oh boy, rolled a natural 20. Oh, oh my. That's with a two-handed weapon. Fuck. Lucius's old man bones are about to feel a lot older. Dude, you need to get your beat stick out. This young, this youngian just came up to you. <laughs> Give it you his beat stick. Don't, don't you oh, accept my. this? Ooh. Lucius, you just noticed this big dude with a two-handed club, probably the size of a small child, raises it up, and you don't even know what to do. You have nowhere to go. You're being protected by a shield on one side. There's a giant open fire next to you. You have little choice but to just brace up and take it. It cracks across your shoulder. It feels like you've broken a couple of bones. You take 16 points of damage. Jesus. Oh, yeah. Ouch. Nope. That hurts. Ow. All right. Oh, I've got a raid. Sorry. What's that? <sighs> we've, got, we've got a raid of six. Thank you, Martin, for the raid. I appreciate it. Oh, shit. We've got 23 viewers now. Hello, everyone. Thank you for joining us. More archers are firing at Dresda. Excellent. The more ones shot at me, the less at Theo. One arrow gets very close. It scrapes across your pauldron and almost cuts into your neck, but none of them connect. This is insulting. They got close. How dare they? One of the spearmen is aware that the back line is being threatened and turns around to engage Theo. <laughs> it takes him two actions to get there, so he only gets to attack once. Ah, so you want to be a hero? They always do. Your AC is 20? Yes. <laughs> he got a 19. He was close. Woo, I'll leave it yourself, peasant. He comes up and you get ready for it. You're kind of bouncing on the balls of your heels. You're ready for it. But he comes in with an unexpected angle and you just barely manage to footwork your way away from it. You're impressed with the interesting attack pattern that he had. Avalyn. Barry, thank you so much for the raid. I really appreciate it, buddy. Um, 
Thank you so much. Thank you so much for putting a link up to um, Marty's chat as well, mods. I really appreciate that. Ivy, that was really, I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. We are playing Pathfinder, guys. Pathfinder is just d d but it's its own little system and its own world. So I appreciate everyone coming to join. Um, it is very role play. So it, we talk about the actions we want to do, what we're going to do in the next action, stuff like that. In that direction? So, I could. I um I you will be kind of talking there and then shove in that direction to these guys and use. I'm really yeah, sorry actually, about that. I, will take but I appreciate the, chance, the support, guys. Hopefully, hopefully you enjoy it. I'm gonna move this way and then try and do a shove into the fire. So athletics check, ye. Yes. Nice. Not terrible. I just not think... good enough though. Ah. <laughs> Not good enough. Uh, no. He well, sees what you're trying to do, and he is surprisingly strong. And he just kind of digs his heels into the ground, and as he is slowly being backed into the fire, he just barely manages to push you off of him. Okay. Well, that was two of my actions. When in doubt, great sorted out. <laughs> when in doubt, get the great sort out. <laughs> No, great, sort it out. Oh, great, sort it out. I like it. <laughs> See, puns. <laughs> uh, hopefully an 18 hits. <laughs> is, the dream a lot, is the dream real? An 18 most certainly does. As he Fantastic. is trying to push you away, and he shoves you off of him, he leaves his body exposed. And you overhand swing your sword, and you cleave him I... across the chest. It is quite Can painful. I... Just for thematics, can I versatile piercing that as he shoves me back and I rush forward with a thrust? Oh, you want to take my fun away from me. Fine. You don't he pushes me... you away. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Avalyn gets to, to deeply penetrate him. He <laughs> feels enthralled as you enter him. <laughs> Are you better now? Are you happy? Uh, I mean, wait. it's not often that I get to penetrate a man. Is this is this still D and D here? Or? <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> Fifty uh, Shades of Pathfinder here. If you really want, if you well, really want, I can get out the sultry voice. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm literally going to I'm literally going to say this. V will go there. I remember the last game. He. Oh, he I most really certainly will. Do winning. not try me. Trying to play no. gay chicken with Eric does not work. Trust me. <laughs> I am the king of gay chicken. <laughs> Me and Will have tried, and I don't think me and Will lost, but it was a tie. Uh, yeah. <laughs> no, uh. I, uh, I will back down, because I've had enough experiences with V fucking around with me. <laughs> <laughs> it's, a hey. it's a smart thing. <laughs> this, this is a family-friendly show. No details. I made oh, no, listen. I, I, listen, no, I, 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 pur I purposely put in here, this is not for kids. So uh, is 18 plus. <laughs> oh, well then. I guess. Move, moving on with life. We still have a <laughs> battle to win. Sensors we can do ERP later. <laughs> the ERP. Yes. All right. Whenever somebody makes a bad decision and fucks the necromancer. <laughs> wait, oh, wait, wait. You just Some you wait. Do. Just you wait. So I have to get my case. I say, did somebody just get challenged? <laughs> This what... archer moves up and aligns to fire at you. Ooh, he actually hit you. Not for very much, though. Theo, you get popped in the shoulder for four damage. He'll try one more, but I don't think it's going to land. It does not. I just look at him and I'm like, you filthy commoner. <laughs> you fucking peasant. You dare use a bow against me? All right. Theo is not a warden. He doesn't get the free perception check. Uh, the three of you on the front lines all get free perception checks, though. Huh. Try. There we go. Or not. Lucius is still reeling from having his shoulder shattered. You rolled twice. 
I, I clicked once and nothing popped up, so I tried it again. Oh, it's just, just that delayed it. That's sometimes that happens yeah. in 20. Avalon, you get a roll as well. Or not, if you don't want to. You're muted, Art. Art. Art might have been consumed by the darkness. Thor got too flustered by speaking about entering the darkspawn route. Mm -hmm. Had to go rub one out real quick. Someone might have knocked on the door or something like that. All right, well, you guys passed the... Pers well, Drastog passed the perception check anyway, so... Two more well, dudes well. have become revealed and are right here. Okay. Shit. They both engage Avalon. Ah, uh, fuck, she's not in my cover radius. And attacks either side, so they gain flanking. Guys, we got this. First attack yeah. misses. Second stepped, misses. Fucking stepped away and failed to notice this shit. God oh, damn it. here you are. My parents are hollering at me, so... Oh, that's never my, fun. Oh. My, my sister's uh, baby shower is today, and they're asking me if I was going to be going, and I told them no, because my sister's on my shit list right now. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Sorry, I should be hey, off that. <laughs> my sister's been on my shit list for many years, so I understand it. <laughs> Avalon, you are sympathize. found yourself surrounded by two darkspawn with spears and they are poking and poking at you one of them actually gets through your shield oh you see my ac i don't have a shield uh, i wish i had the shield but it's not too much way. you get stabbed for six but that means that the uh that means that the ranger has six less health that is mm. correct <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. I will live. I have 53. Come here. Hey, stop ignoring me. There you go. <laughs> Brit attacking stop you. Ignoring me. Does he hit the 25? The first attack does. Okay. Second attack does not. Okay. Drastov, even though all the training that you've had enduring multiple attacks from multiple angles, it is just too much to keep up with it all. And Big Brute Dude does get an overhand swing on you, and you don't get your shield and brace in time. That will crack you for 17. Easy. Without a critical? Without yep. a critical? They hit hard. They are very, very strong. Well, I guess I take half and you take the other half. Yep. Which way okay. do you want which way do you want around that? I'll take the higher round. I'll take the higher higher rounding. Oh, okay. The person who gets hit will always take the higher round. So that puts me down to twenty-eight. Archer bro over here that is trying to engage with Theo tries to dishonorably get behind you, Theo, and tries to stab you with a short sword. <laughs> You're old a net twenty. Wow. The return of Chaos Headshot Ninja XX has, has come. And that's a shitty damage roll. A critical hit for only eight. Theo, you're alive? Yeah. No glib remark? I'm disappointed. No. Just, uh, I'm just waiting for you to actually do your rolls in roll 20 so we can actually see them. I roll the <laughs> dice on the desk. <laughs> I know, listen, you, you, you do you, I'm just saying. Um, I am going he's, to... He's calling you a pussy is what he is. I don't care what he says. I, I roll the dice I if I want to. didn't say anything. I am going to jump over here. Acrobatics for Panache, probably. Yes. 15. Does it beat the basic bitch is the question. I mean, I don't, I don't see them having a good. What is it? Will or something like that you said, Leon? This would be against their reflex DC, I believe. Yes. The one dude with a short sword tries to keep up with you. The dude with the bow has no way to respond to you anyway. So you lazily roll, or you easily roll past. 
Yeah. Uh, that's the little bugger's getting it. Are you going to penetrate him like Avalon did? Oh my. Straight through the rear. The German special. Don't stop till you hit the back of his teeth. <laughs> I think that will do it. We can, yeah, we can, we, can, we, can continue, we continue this dance of death, do we not? Oh, daddy, that went right through him. The, uh, the dude Aye, above or below you? Oh, that's one he'd have already had. That's, that's little fucker. Oh, the dude who was already on his deathbed? Yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> you just spear him right through the back as he's trying to keep up with you. And you feel yourself cutting underneath his rib cage and going right through his heart. As soon as you pull the weapon from him, he just immediately drops over. Then this little guy down below me's getting it. Yep. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that is a critical hit. Even with that, you with the minus five penalty. Holy shit! Oh right, you yeah, have the minus five, so no, it is not a crit, but it is a success. I should. She, I should just chop my mouth. I should just yeah, chop my mouth. On. Yep. Yeah, you but, should. But, uh, let Eric make his mistakes. Yeah, hey, everyone fucks up. But you fucked up this time. Hey, I am honest. I'm a rules lawyer. But oh, I'm boy. Lawyer. oh boy with the bow is still trying to find a way to defend himself from you, but is completely helpless against a melee weapon with a bow in his hand. And just tries to brace himself for the hit, you stab him right through the throat, and he is drowning in blood, but not dead yet. Um... And that will be the end of my turn. Lucius, we are on round three. Is there any penalty for trying to smash this guy in front of me with a uh, with an alchemist alchemist fire? That is a ranged weapon. Everyone around you would take splash damage. They will not because I am bomber specialty. Which does, you can control how the splash works. That last paragraph there, it's when throwing a bomb. You're not throwing it. Ah. You're like taking it in your hand and slapping it in him. Right? Gotcha. Uh, well, I figured as much since he's in melee with me. Uh -huh. Well, splash is only one point. so that's Hey, we've be... seen your effectiveness with the, the old man beat stick. I don't know what you're afraid of. Let me double check and see what the splash is on this. I might risk it anyway. It's, I mean... If it means think? killing the enemy, it's worth it. Primary target instead of the usual splash area, so as long as you hit... Yep. I'm gonna go for it. So, so basically, just hit. And you are flanking, so there you go. 25. Which one? The dude directly next to you? Yeah, the guy who, who beat me over the head. Correct. Yeah, roll your damage. Ooh. 11 and an additional two. Oh, 13. He'll take two persistent fire. He is now on fire and is very, very angry with you. This will teach you to hit your elders. Perfect. That'll be the oh, on geez. fire. And oh, uh, everyone around him is going to take the splash, though. And seeing as how pretty much don't want to light everybody else on fire, but I got him. Now I'll just resort to the beat stick. The fire is on their turn. The persistent, yeah. I gotta adjust a whole bunch of tabs here. All right, you've got two actions left. Yeah, follow up with the uh, with the beat stick. First one missed. Attack for five and an attack for one. Yeah, yeah I twos. don't <laughs> think that hit anything. Nope. Well played. Dressed well, up. First action, raise shield. Second action, hunt prey. Third action, twin takedown. You can tell who the German in the group is. <laughs> Wait, I thought Ash I mean, died. Yes. So efficient. Well, 
So that's a 26 and an 18. Does an 18 hit? An 18 does. So he takes a grand total of 6 plus 9, so there you go. My turn is over. Drakon lays into this dude, or Drastov lays into this dude with a pick and then follows it with a shield bag. Wallops the dude real good. Is a 26 a critical? 26 is not a critical. Nah, a shame. A man can dream. That brute is not looking good. Still alive. He is swaying on his feet and looking like he's zoning in and out of consciousness. All right, Theo. You are going to give me a reflex check. A reflex? I mean, would I not? Would I not? Would I not get a perception? I mean, other people, I imagine, would get perceptions with me doing stealth. So if this person's being stealth, I would. Yes, imagine. you'll get a stealth uh, perception check. And then after, I'll do the the uh, reflex. Yeah, I don't see. That. <laughs> okay, give me a reflex check. What's that? There you go, 21. Okay. As you are dueling with these dudes, you hear something thunder around the corner in this direction, and you respond to it in time to brace yourself from whatever it was, and it looks like a darkspawn is riding on top of a large wolf. What? We have ward riders. One of them tried to jump on you, and you feel like it tried to drag you down to the ground once you held your ground. But it will make a normal attack. Holy shit. It bit you really hard, but you held your ground and didn't fall down. It bit you for seven. Wait, what? It still attacked me? It still attacked you, yes. You didn't get dragged onto the ground. Okay. It tried to bite you and do a takedown. More in mooks. One engages Avalon. Miss. And miss. Avalon circle parries a couple strikes away with her sword. We have one more dude. The dude attacking dressed up. Miss. Miss, and his third attack is hopeless. He can never hit you with the third attack. Our archer line is now revealed as they've engaged too close. And these archers on the south are absolutely fucking worthless and haven't hit anything yet. Spear dude attacking dressed up. Can't hit anything. Theo, another perception. This one you catch. Another ward rider is barreling towards you. So its attack will not get the bonus against you. But it will attack you. Theo is getting really in over his head. Theo, another ward, tries to grab you and drag you down. An athletics check. Yeah, acrobatics? Acrobatics. Or no, this is a physical resistance. So athletic. It's not trying to, like, outroll you. It's trying to just physically grab you and manhandle you. So it's an athletic. I'm, I'm just asking them because you said it was reflex before. And it was doing the exact same thing. So how does that change? It was a reflex because it completely surprised you. Okay, well, I'm going to feel this then. Yep. 
Theo is prone. It mauls you for another six damage. Theo is getting devoured. So I didn't see these guys with my perception at the very start. No, because they were hiding in a different section of the building. Those ladders that the wags climbed up, yeah? No, they were in this room over here. They were hiding down here. The brute that's barely alive is going to try again to take out Lucius. And he is too beat up to swing his weapon properly and swings and flails wildly. Archer line trying again. This time they're going to go for Avalon because they cannot hit Drastov. One hits. Avalon, you get shot for six. Hey, Eric, that, uh, that big dude, he took his two fire damage, right? Sorry, I completely lost my train of thought. One dude moving out. Avalon. Hey, Eric, real quick, did that... Uh, I didn't hear if you... Or I don't know if you heard me. The guy who swung at me and missed, did he take his two persistent fire? He did. Okay. He has one hit point left. Ah, it was so close. Okay, well. Frankly, there's so many fucking enemies, I'm not even sure what to do here. <laughs> it's not unreasonable. You guys can handle it. Each of the enemies doesn't have much HP. The brute took, like, 17 damage so far and hasn't died. <laughs> Those ones have a lot of HP. The little dudes have very little. I make an attack against the brute. See if I can finish it off since it's basically dead. If you land an attack, you die. Uh huh. That will do. Even <laughs> shit damage, but it's enough. You overhead swing as he is flailing at Lucius, and you cleave his head straight through. His brain falls on the floor. <laughs> well, that's one less problem. Yep. I guess I'm gonna go and swing at the one of the spearmen. To my sides, I'll go for that guy. Get it? A nine. Well, that will not do. No, of course I wouldn't. <laughs> nine? <laughs> Base AC is usually ten in some games. Oh. Uh, yeah, I didn't even roll the right one. That, was ac that actually would have been like a four. Or whatever for the second attack. Well, you had a natural roll of a two on that. Yeah, I know. You got one more. You can try again. <laughs> At a minus ten. Do you have anything better to do? You have three actions. You may as well try them. Well, I'll say fucking yeah. Fish. I have something better to do. Fucking dream. <laughs> <laughs> Girl, I told 20. you. <laughs> Always go for the crit fish. <laughs> okay. Uh, you take a swing at the dude, and he kind of deflects it off of his shield, but as he catches it, he is so overwhelmed by how much might was behind you. He is totally surprised as you slide your shield back and you swing it back into you, clasping it over the back of his head. And he drops to the floor and is bleeding heavily. <laughs> well, good. <laughs> it's one less problem to deal with. <laughs> and you doubted the third attack. Yeah, I did. Archer up here thinks that Theo is taken care of and is just going to wander the fuck off. Other spear dude on Adeline. Misses. Misses. And doesn't get the nat 20 on the third attack like Adeline did and missed all three. That dude is dead, out of the turn order. The other brute still trying to hit Drastov. Doesn't connect. My worthless archer line.
are completely fucking useless. Miss everything. All right, we're about to start round five, and I'm going to call a five-minute break in place because we're at just over two hours. <laughs>